Several bills focused on reforming Sewerage and Water Board have been signed now into law by Governor Jeff Landry. The measures aimed at making it easier for you to make payments and even dispute your bills. WDSU reporter Shay O'Connor live at the Sewerage and Water Board office with the changes that should soon be on the way. Shay. Good evening to you, Travers and Sella. Yeah, Governor Landry pretty much says that this is a huge step forward. The bills that were signed today focus on three key issues here at Sewage and Water Board New Orleans. That's billing, drainage, and operations. The billing piece is so crucial in restoring trust in the Sewage and Water Board system for the residents of New Orleans. So my bill is pretty simple and straightforward, Governor. All it says is that the Sewage and Water Board can only bill for actual consumption. No more estimated bills. So Governor Jeff Landry signing bills by these lawmakers into law Tuesday. One would require an arbitration process for contesting your water bills. Ever since the pandemic, my bill jumped up by the thousands. Another would consolidate tasks for the embattled department. And it's simple. All we're simply saying is drainage should be the responsibility of the sewage and water. We caught up with people experiencing high bills. She had a $23,000 water bill, for God's sake. Like New Orleans native Wanda Thomas, who says she's been trying to lower rates for her mother. There's a lot of poor people in here that can't even afford some of these water bills. We, we got to get it together because it's, it's for what happens for everyone. The hope is for true change to the system and not just talk. The governor says this is only the first step. In no way. Do we believe that this is going to be the panacea or that tomorrow the sewage and water board is going to be fixed? But this is a committed effort. And the sewage and water board of New Orleans responding to today's signing. You should see it there on your screen saying in part, quote, we appreciate Senator Harris and all our state partners support time and attention to our utility and our customers. The agency also says that they are ready and willing to take on additional drainage system responsibilities, assuming that funding will also be provided. We'll have much more on this at 10 p.m. reporting live from sewage and water board of New Orleans. Orleans, Shay O'Connor, WDSU News.